Two people that were kind of on it, but I was between one of them. The first that I went to, which is the person that I got this from, this is a, a medium, by the way. This is a medium bonnet, but it's really big. Um, I guess I could show you all how it looks on my head. And the name of her business is The Regal Lifestyle. You could follow her on Instagram. She was really pleasant, really nice. Um, the other girl, she was not so pleasant, so I did not spend money with her. Yeah, we're not doing that. Mm -mm. We're not doing that. But this one, it was $35, which to me is good because, I mean, come on, it's handmade and it looks good. <laughs> so, I'm sorry, person, if I have any money for something and I really like it, I'm going to buy it. So, yeah. Alright, so I'm going to pack up my hair so I can show you guys. How it looks. Let me wrap it. See how long my hair is? But yeah, ow. Okay, so I'm just a bit. Right. So at in 
beginning I was doing it wrong I was actually tying it like this like to the front <laughs> but I realized it was coming on done like when I was sleeping so my best friend told me to do it to the back and she was correct because it fits way better so let me show you guys as I said this is a medium and honestly I thought it was gonna be too small but when I got home and I you know put it on and stuff I realized it was like literally perfect I need to get another one a bigger one so when I get my, my longer braids it will fit perfect okay wait let me just fix the front and just tighten it Right, and then bring to the front. And you can put it as tight as you want, whichever you're comfortable with. Oh my god, I can't find my finger. Okay, perfect, got it. So this is the one it. So cute, isn't it? It's so cute. And it does not come off when I'm sleeping. Since we put it like the correct way. And even if the back is open a little bit, the sign on my back is gonna still protect your hair. So I really love it. I'm very satisfied. And my best friend bought me this scrunchie from her as well. They were getting like two scrunchies for five dollars and my favorite color is green. So I have to get this like minty color one. Super cute. Um, my best, as I said, right, my best friend bought this for me. I also bought from her this um oh, I also bought this from her. This is um like when you're washing your face so you don't like wet your edges and stuff like that. I haven't used it as yet, but I really liked it. So I just bought it because I don't know when next I'm gonna see it or whatever the case is. So um, I actually wanted black milk, but I was like, you know, you have too much black stuff. So let's get a different color. So I ended up going this pretty, pretty blue. Um, I don't know what you consider it. it's like a navy blue. I'm not sure, but I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love her shop. So I was definitely purchasing some more stuff from her. It came in a brown bag, but I have the bag upstairs. This is another bag from another business that I purchased some stuff from. And this bonnet is so cute. I'm take a picture. Okay. <laughs> okay, so these are the stuff that I got from her. These I bought this and this, so this was ten dollars for this, and thirty five. I said so that was forty five dollars I spent with her. And she also, I didn't even realize that I had. I got this until I got home, but she also put in my bag eleven twenty four cosmetics. So this is her brand as well, and it is a sample of a vanilla lip scrub. The ingredients are organic sugar, shea butter, sweet almonds oil, coconut oil, ceratic acid, e-wax preservative, and flavoring oil. And it is made locally right here in Barbados. Um, I have not tried it yet, to be honest. I wanted to do the video first before I open it and, you know. And they also have a, a code, like a, like a scan, the thing, so... Let's see how this, I'm just about to keep on it off my head because it was like quite hot. Wait, let me just take it off. It looks like it's quite hot. But yeah, I love this bonnet and I would definitely be purchasing another one from her. Because I follow her on Instagram. But yeah, this bonnet is super cute. And I love it, I love it, I love it. Wait, I don't want to do that again. And it is super cute and this was one that was on the display mannequin um the other ones i didn't like so much this one really catch my attention so we end up going behind this one so let's wrap that there okay 
Okay, so let's let's scrub now. Let me turn it down a little bit. Great. Oh, you guys can hear me properly. I'm singing properly. But right, this is the vanilla. Let's see. Mmm, it smells so good. Mmm. I don't know if you guys can see it. I don't want to drop out, but yeah, guys, like, this smells. Like you could eat it, like it smells so good. I'm gonna put wipe off my top bit. Let's just get a little bit. You could eat it, but you could get any more. I don't know. I, I haven't exfoliated my lips in like two days because I did it too much and I have a cut. I will scrap right there, have you cut? But yeah, yeah, it tastes good because obviously in your, on your lips, so you make your taste of it. But yeah, so I will definitely be supporting her business again. She was really nice, she was really pleasant. Pleasant is the key word. And um, yeah. Oh, uh, I don't know. I can probably go off this. But yeah. Okay, so those are the stuff I got from her, and as I said, her name, her business name is The Rico Lifestyle. You can follow her on Instagram. Um, the next thing I bought was this. Wait, I think I have her. Right, this is her business page. I mean, this is her business card. And it is 11.24 vegan and cruelty free handmade cosmetics and body care. Her Instagram is 11.24. Like you have to actually spell out 11.24. Stare at the bottom. And then for the bonnet, it is the same contact number. So her contact number is Obviously, if you're in Barbados, it's 246-247-7069. And her Instagram for the satin bonnets are Regal Satin Bonnets. And you could email her at regalsatinbonnets at gmail.com. And for the lip scrub or the... Because she had the other stuff, like... um, She had, like, beard oil for the guys. She had um, lip balms. You know, a lot of natural stuff. And the email address for that is 1124 at gmail.com. So, big up to you. I don't even remember her name. I don't think I know her name. But, yeah, she was really nice and pleasant. Um, the next thing I bought was this um, dual, dual N Acne Extractor Toolkit. I don't even know what I really... I guess. I don't, I don't know. I haven't used it as yet. But I have like some blackheads, blackheads, but you know little woodheads that I can I can try and see how it works. And this was six dollars. Um I don't even know the name of the booth I was at to be honest. Because my my best friend and I should ride with us walking around and we stopped at that particular booth and she had like makeup but I don't wear makeup in terms of like every day like if i'm gonna get my makeup then i'm gonna pay some but i'm not gonna do it myself so i didn't make sense to me buying that sort of stuff but i did give her a sale and i bought this so this was six so i should have a little calculator to do to like calculate like, how much i spent so far because my budget was 100 guys and i went way over 100 because there were too many good stalls to not give a sale support small local businesses sorry as i said with rico the girl i spent 45 because i said right my best friend bought me the scrunchie so i didn't purchase that so i spent 45 dollars i mean i spent 45 dollars hmm. i spent 45 dollars with her and this was six dollars for another booth so that's 45 46 47 48 49 50 51 dollars so far the next thing that i bought was 
this. So, and this is from three. Who up three? This bag here. It came in this bag, and this is Journeys Natural Blends. The ingredients and the soap is a turmeric herbal soap. It lightens hyper pen hyper pigmentation and it's handmade it's five ounces which is this is huge see the size of this it's huge i would definitely purchase it for her again but i have to try it first before i can feel that but in terms of the size this for ten dollars guys ten dollars for this the ingredients are castor oil cocoa butter coconut oil olive oil palm oil turmeric shea butter sunflower oil Saponified oils, oh, saponified oils and essential oils. And guys, it smells so nice. I can't wait to use it. I wanted to use it like yesterday from the soap ran out that I was using before, but I wanted to do video and I didn't have time yesterday to do video, so I had to wait. So when that one finished, the new soap right open, and then I would use my new soap. And she was really pleasant. Um, so yeah, it was ten dollars. So how much I said. I bought so that's 51 that's 61 dollars so far it's me and that's one two three four five six stuff okay um i bought these earrings from there was like a rastafarian guy and his friend and they had like a, a table i knew him when i used to work in skema his voice was so pleasant and unfortunately she died and her sister as well I used to work with her and I felt so like sad for him because she was so nice last name piece that bro I can't remember what this name crap the rain coming down anyway right um so I bought these from him I needed I originally have a pair of these earrings but I have the regular one of the biggest one there is so I just needed something a little smaller. Like it's not everywhere gonna wear a big hoop. So I need something smaller. These are ten dollars and I love them. They're stainless steel. So okay, so that's 61, 71. I also bought oh no, I didn't buy that from him, sorry. I also bought these other earrings from him and these are some like cubic zacronia, but the stem is Surgical steel. And these are so cute. These were also ten dollars, so I spent twenty dollars with him. And um, so that's eighty one. These are so cute. I love them. I saw. So sorry, I didn't get the other size down, cause I need to put the earring in my this other my second hole. But I honestly ran out of money to be honest. Like if it's one thing I regret, regret it's not taking enough money. But I have money, but it was on my card, and there was no, there wasn't a first card being card machine, so and he didn't have first base, so yeah. But God willing, hopefully he will be at the one in December, and I will definitely be purchasing some more stuff from him because I really love these earrings. Um, he, the guy that was with him also, guys, no, this guy has some beautiful anklets, some chains, stainless steel, bracelets. There wasn't a lot of options for bracelet, but I really want a bracelet. And guys, look at this. This is actually an anklet. Look, I am in love with this. Do you see how pretty it is? I love it. It does hearts and it has different colors. I think the green really attract me for my favorite color. It's green. Um, it is a bit big for my wrist. Even for my, it fits on my ankle, but I don't wear ankle yet, so I wouldn't wear it there. But I really love it. I'm so sorry I didn't get another one because I need another one. This is beyond cute. And this was $20, guys. It is stainless steel. I don't take it off. I bear with it. It's really good. You see the space it has there. I tried tightening it, but it can't be bothered to be honest. I was gonna like pop off the link, but I tell myself it don't make sense doing that because I might destroy it. So I'm just gonna leave it as it's 
but I really, 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 really love it. So, right, how much I was at again? I think I was at 71, 81. I can't remember. So how much I at now? So it's 81 and 10 and 20 is like 110, something like that. And oh yeah, I bought a soap for my granny as well, but I don't have it. Obviously, I gave it to her. And it was a um a Pari mango made soap. I hope you guys can hear me because we ran in Okay. I hope you guys can hear me. But yeah. So I bought my granny a soap and I thought it was five dollars. Um but I gave it for her. Um let me go and check and see if I could if I could bring it just to me on Okay guys, so I am back. I was able to get a soap from my granny room to show you all. It's only like two things I want to be able to show you all because there are gifts for my best friends that were able to come and I don't want to like, post it and I don't know when I can see them yet. So I don't want to think I see what it's before, but it's just, I really at that point I will show y'all. Okay, so this soap is made from a pari mango, which is a mango, which is in here in Barbados. And guys, it smells so good. Um, the name of the business is Azor. I don't really want to fill the package. But yeah, which when you said it was a party, I was like, yeah, let's give me it. I know my granny loves my books. Uh, I know she really appreciated it. So I got that for her. This was only $5, guys. So I got that for her. Let me make sure I put it in the paper properly. So that was for my granny. She did not be doing granny at all. Um, right from her also, I got this. It's like to, you know, wash your face. My husband bought this for me. This was only five dollars. You had your own face. You like, you know, your whole body. But I didn't end up getting it. I mean, but next thing when I go. But yeah. And great. Let me see what else they have here. I bought these two scrunchies from my girl Katrina. Big up to turn up Team Boutique. Um, I bought these two scrunchies from her as well as a nail ring for my bestie. Um, I so in total I spent fifteen dollars at her booth because these were two for five and the nail ring was ten dollars. So yeah, I bought those two. I don't have a lot of scrunchies, so like, let me get these. And if, oh yeah, I also bought my other best friend, I girl, um, a pair of earrings, and that was ten dollars from the same lady that I bought this chain from. It is a rose, and guys, it took me forever to decide what I wanted because I initially saw she had a chain that had a cat, but I have two cats and a dog. So I was like, I can't get it because that really is an injustice for my jacket boy, which is my dog. So I couldn't get that one. And then, that's not the nice ones too. But my husband, my best friend, Cheryl, helped me choose this one. It was a rose. And this was $20. Yeah, guys. I also supported this local business called Fruits. And guys, let me tell you, I can't even get it finished because they so, I, yes, they are so good. And this was only six dollars for this is the flavor is ginger and lime there are absolutely no preservatives in it it's a consume one day over after opening but oh my god crap it gone off damn it gone off now but guys it was really nice and i really liked it so i would definitely purchase from them if I go somewhere but I will make it at home with ginger and but if I go somewhere and they were there I would definitely get them you know a few seals because uh, my husband had a lemonade because it wasn't lemonade it was a lemonade and yeah it was pretty good 
I also had this, um, when we got through the entrance, um, Chefet Frosties were giving you the, they have these lollipops, not lollipops, sorry, these lollies, but they're alcohol in fields, and it was like lamp, lamp flavor. It wasn't bad, it was my first time tasting it. Um, also, Ole, the people that sometimes not that who does Ole, they did this amazing thing. I just want to actually insert some clips of the expo and what I was talk what I here talking about now in terms of the Ole snack. But they crushed the arcade. So, they ask you what you want, which flavor you want. I had ranch, and then you could add cheek, like crush the the thing in her hand in the bag, the Ole. And then you get to choose if you want a ground beef or you want chicken. And I chose ground beef. And then you could choose from guacamole, salsa, jalapeno, cheese, barbecue sauce, aioli. There was like um, a whole variety of different things. I just totally put everything on it. I got corn, everything. I got everything on it. And guys, that was the best. Like, whoever on their marketing team did a race because that was phenomenal. But they got me because I thought it was free. Initially, I thought it was free, so I got it. And then they were like, you pay it. I was like, oh no. So then it was only $10, but this is probably the best $10 I ever spent in regards to food. Like, that is so good. Like, I was telling my husband, we have to make that. We have to try it and see how it is because it is so good. Like, but I already had a, an, an amazing time at the cloth lifestyle pop up shop. It was so good. I cannot wait for the one December. I'm gonna make sure I walk with at least like three hundred dollars because there were so much other stores I didn't really get to go to, and I know if I did go, I would spend some money. I also was able to sign up for my Price Smart card. Um, it was eighty two dollars, and I got the joint one for me and my husband. For my husband and I, and you know, Price Smart it is last a year, so we end up. Um, we went yesterday sunday because it is monday and yeah we bought some stuff but yeah it was really good i can't wait i can't wait to go back it was it was really good guys i can't complain it was, it was my first time actually i when i have my um online store fashion frenzy which i will be opening back up which it is actually open back up um but in the past i wanted to get a booth at the same cloth place but i didn't bother big i never know why i didn't bother but i just didn't bother but i definitely had an amazing time i can't stop ripping about it because i don't go out i am not an outside person i don't go partying nothing like that so when i actually go somewhere and i enjoy myself i feel good that i spent my time going to something that i enjoyed and was worth going to so yeah guys i had an amazing time Thank you for tuning in. I hope you guys liked everything that you saw I bought. And in total, I probably spent like $175 or something like that. Or maybe a little less. I'm not even sure. Because then when my husband came, he bought some stuff. He bought this for me. Oh, he bought that and he bought the soap for me. I think. Yeah. So it was for me. So by the time he came, it was the evening. I had already bought the, the, all the U.S. And stuff. But I had... I can't stop saying it. I had a great thing. <laughs> so thank you guys for tuning in. I will see you guys shortly because I will do my birthday is next month. I will be turning 25. I will be vlogging. But yeah guys, I hope you guys enjoyed my video and I will see you guys later. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe.